Strong wind, right? Yes. <laughs> Hello. 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 Hi, hi. Hi, Alejandra. Hello, Ale. Hello. All right, mm -hmm. Natalie. Good evening, Walter. Eric, the new Eric. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good evening, and Jose, Elmer, Eli, Hello, Eli. Hi, Diego. Hi, Flor. Hello. How's everybody today? Everybody okay? Yes. Excellent, Eli. Bien, sabe que si no enciende la cámara la voy a regañar. All right. <laughs> Very good. Para right. que no me pregunte. Ajá, hoy voy a preguntarle a las que tienen la cámara encendida. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. All right, very good. Hi, Anna. Welcome. All right, very good. Hi, everyone. All right. Eric, porque puso la cámara oculta. No sé si. Hi, Elmer. Teacher. Good evening, my dear teacher. What happened to you yesterday, Elmer? I sleep early, teacher. My goodness. I go to my bed. You early. went to your bed uh, early. Yeah. Qué envidia. Yes, All right. That's for me. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Very good. All right. Okay, guys. So yesterday we were talking about <laughs> we were talking about these model things. All right, that complicated our lives yesterday for a little bit. Um, this is what we're going to do. I'm gonna show you this again because it's here. It's right here, all right? Nothing from the other world. It's just that I, I think I took it on the wrong way. But anyway, here we're talking about recommendations and opinions, okay? Now, it, it, this is what it's important for us to know. This model, mo, like passive models, y desde ahí empezó la confusión. Una cosa son los verbos, like model verbs, and another thing is passive models, all right? The passive models are the same model verbs, but in the passive form, okay? So when, let's, let's, let's clarify it from the beginning because when we understand passive models, that means that we're going to use the past participle of the verbs because we're talking about the passive form, okay? With that in mind, guys, then this is what we're supposed to do. When you think of something is a good idea, we're gonna go back and we're gonna say, okay, we may use should, shouldn't, and ought to, but because we're talking about passive models, all right, then we have to use the verb be, no conjugation of it, just be as such, plus the P of the following verb, the past participle of the following verb. That's why this is like, I mean, this is why this is shown here. Cyclists should be required to wear a helmet, okay? So this is passive model. So that means that you're using should, which is a model verb, plus be, plus require, the past participle. Ayer veíamos, y en muchos, eh, no sé si todos, pero algunos nos confundimos y solo decíamos, cyclists should wear a helmet. Ok, ese es un verbo, o es una oración con un verbo modal en presente simple. Ok, la diferencia entre eso de ayer y ahora, o bueno, también ayer, pero creo que lo, lo, lo llevé yo como mal, es que estamos viendo los modales en forma pasiva. All right, por lo tanto, we need to use be plus the past participle right after the modal verb, which is, which is should, shouldn't, or ought. Ok. All right, Noemi is not going to be able to come into class. Okay, so is that clear, guys? Did we understand it? I mean, do we understand it now better than yesterday? La idea ahorita es usar los, mod los verbos modales en su forma pasiva. Por lo tanto, usamos el verbo modal plus be plus the past participle of any verb that we want to express a recommendation or our opinion. Do you have questions so far? Vamos a detenerlo ahí y le puedo enseñar lo otro que está aquí. All right, que era lo mismo de ayer. Okay, here, y decíamos, ¿cuál es, what is the difference between should and ought to? Should is something that you think is best for you, and ought to is more like an obligation, more like a law, more like a duty, an obligation that you have to do. 
That is the difference between should and ought. Como estamos usando lo pasivo, la, de, su forma pasiva decimos should. Okay, um, sorry to interrupt. Okay, yeah. Um, so I can use out, uh, for example, a synonym of, um, for example, mandatory. Yeah, more, like something yeah. like. It is not so mandatory, uh, Mario, because it's, you're still giving a recommendation, but a very strong recommendation that is almost mandatory, but it's not. Um, yeah? So I can say something like uh, employees at the supermarket, they out to, they out. Uh, they ought to hold on, be. Hold on. Employees at the supermarket, they out to be wear masks in order to protect themselves from COVID-19 but, but that's and the to thing. stop the spread the, of the virus. It's, Mario, because it's passive, you have to say, masks ought to be worn by employees at the supermarket. Oh, because I see the difference now. About, okay. Yeah, we're talking about the passive, um, the passive forms, yes? All right? Awesome. Got it. Okay, very good. So here, guys, this is what we have to see. This, it's a passive model here, all right? So model plus B plus past participle. All right, for example, in this case, we're using should or shouldn't or ought to because we're giving a recommendation, almost hitting, as Mario was saying, um, like mandatory, but it's not so mandatory because you're recommending, you're giving an opinion, it should be that way because you feel it's the right thing to do, all right? So you say this exercise should be done by all my students. And remember, this is the passive form. Ok, entonces le seguimos dando la vuelta. Por eso ahorita en el ejemplo de Mario, I switched it and I said, mask should be worn by all the employees at the supermarket in order to keep safe. Y sigue hablando lo que quiera. Yeah, but the idea is that you switched it. Ok, the other one, quarantine should be, should be postponed for example or she ought to be prepared for the lesson, all right? Si se fija, estamos usando el should or el shouldn't. En este caso no estoy usando ningún shouldn't, pero podríamos should, shouldn't, or ought to plus B plus past participle. Yes? Guys, yeah? Hola, hola. Yes, Can you hear like me? Roger that. Can I the question in Spanish, please? Sorry, Selena? Can I the question in Spanish? Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Eh, ayer hicimos oraciones, pero usamos un sujeto. Sí. Entonces eso no era pasivo. Porque poníamos, tú deberías hacer tal cosa. Ahí no yeah. es pasivo. No, cuando usted dice, tú deberías estar en clase. Por ejemplo, usted dice, you should be in class. All right. Ahí no estamos, no, no estamos usando el claro. modal en forma pasiva. Bueno, ok. Right. Ok. Cuando lo usamos en forma pasiva, Selina, tenemos que tener esa estructura. El verbo modal en este caso, should, shouldn't, ought to, must, mustn't, all right, or has got, or has, uh, has to, y luego el verbo be, y luego el pasado participio. Yeah? Thank you. Thank you. All right. Okay. So here, guys, this is what I added today. Lo que pasó, que, creo que aquí empezó la confusión que aquí solo teníamos recommendation and opinion. Entonces parecía que era el must, el should, el shouldn't, normal. All right, but no. All right, it's this. It's giving recommendation and opinion with passive. All right? Me escucha. Mm. Yeah, I hear ¿Me escucha? you. escucha? I can barely I hear you. I, I, I hear it's all raining. of the background noises, though. All right. Plus, it's raining here, like cats and dogs. Cats and dogs. <laughs> can you guys take a picture? Can you take a picture? Gone. I think she's gone. 
What? What do you say? <clears throat> Microsoft teacher. Teacher is gone. I don't know about you guys.
Okay, dear yeah, teacher, how are you? Fine, how are you? Uh, yes, I'm fine. How are you? How are you? You have problems yeah. with the Wi-Fi. Right? I, I, I told you with the mind because Why? I, 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 I don't, I don't know if I work with a, uh, uh, should uh, must or uh -huh. only with should. The, depending on the sentence and depending on what example, you want to say. Okay, for example, people must be recycle all disposable products. Is that must must be? In in this case, should be reminded to get married at. Wait wait, wait 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 wait. People shouldn't be allowed to smoke on airplanes. Young people shouldn't be permitted to get married at age, uh, mm -hmm. age 15. People, what is the uh -huh. verb for that one, Elmer and Mario, for number three? For number people three, must three. Be, must be required. Uh, required. required. Uh -huh. Recycle is not the verb. Yes, yes I, 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 I have a discussion with uh, <laughs> most and children. All right. People must be required to recycle. Elmer, or Cito, tomorrow we have no class, Elmer. Huh? We have no class tomorrow. Yeah. Bye. How we do? It's my birthday. Yes, I, I, I go to the <laughs> I go to the dinner, but it's early in the in the in the afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> I know, but uh, I I imagine it's a. Uh, uh, Both, you, have, you, have you have a pass. Maybe you have a pass. If you have a, at night, late at night, it's good. It's good for me. <laughs> you're terrible, Elmer. No, you're nice, okay. okay. Wait, wait, wait. Jessica, Jessica oh. is your crush. <laughs> oiga, oiga, Elmer, qué barbaridad usted. ¿Qué dice? ¿Qué dice Mario? Que I'm your crush. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. All uh, right. Elmer siempre uh, ha sido así desde el año pasado, usted. Uh, All right. O sea, que no, no, le, no le haga caso, dice. Oye, usted. <laughs> <laughs> o sea, sí. Dice. Qué gracioso. <laughs> oh, Elmer, you're terrible. Mire, Elmer, ¿qué pasó? ¿Le contestaron ahora? Ya no. Sí, sí me contestaron. Y, y efectivamente era de que Tenía que llevar toda la documentación de la empresa y firmada por la gerente. Que yo le digo que me va a costar un tanto conseguir la firma. Sí. Entonces, sí, el proceso hay que hacerlo, sí. uno. Y la otra situación es que eh, sí, eh, hay que hacer el cambio porque ya, ya no va a estar este. Pues. Ajá. Ya, no va sí. a, ya no va a estar esta forma. Exacto. Y la otra es que ya no va a estar con usted. ¿Por qué? Ya me dijeron. No, ya me dicen ellos que no. Porque yo le dije, mire, pero quiero estar con el teacher Cerrito. No, me dijeron. No, no le podemos asegurar eso. Pero yo estoy, bueno, y le dije todo lo nuestro, va, pero él, no es tampoco. No, pero yo no, creo que no, sí, Elmer. No, no, no. ¿En serio? Sí, ¿A la misma hora, teacher? ¿De 8 a 10? Ah, ok. Teacher, volviendo a la clase. Ajá. Ok, hoy andas en serio. ¿eh? No, no, es que tengo, de verdad tengo duda. No, 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 no es ganas de estar molestando. Aus tú, esto es algo que yo nunca lo había escuchado. Aus tú, eh, pero es como, como el chud, dice. Pero es menos frecuente escucharlo. Sí. O sea, sí. yo... yo cuando veo porno, no, no sale eso. Ay, no, Elmer, por Dios. <risa> bueno. Por esas cosas pierde conmigo, fíjese. <risa> Ay, no, mire, Mario, se está riendo de usted, Marcito. Qué barbaridad. Ah, no, ya no, perdiste es, puntos bien. ahí, Elmer, la regalé. Sí, no ahí, ahí lo voy a ganar mañana en la cena. <risa> Sí, pues, Todo está cerrado, Elmer. Ah, bueno. Pues sí, eh, no se oye frecuentemente, Ticha. No, de hecho, más, mucho más común el should. El, el also should. a veces pareciera que es como más formal. Uh -huh. Y hay gente que le diría lo contrario, que no es tan formal como el should. Pero uh -huh. se usa, pero no es que se use tanto. 
¿verdad? Solo que entre el should y el low to, lo que veíamos ayer es que puede ser intercambio, o sea, puede, se puede ser usado uno o el otro, pero el ought to es más tirado a una recomendación casi que se vuelve algo obligatorio, ¿me entiende? Pero todavía Ajá. cabe dentro de la recomendación. No así ¿Ah? con el must y el has to o el has got to, que eso ya es una necesidad absoluta que puede ser hasta convertirse en una ley, por ejemplo. O sea, cuando, cuando hablamos de cuarentena, por ejemplo, podríamos decir how to be eh, required eh, more time. Followed for, by for... many people, ajá. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. The quarantine okay. must be followed by many people, for example. Ah, ok. Thank you, thank Or the you. quarantine has to be respected by everybody. Ok. Yeah. Eh, will, will, will you share the PPT after the class, teacher? Yes, I will. Eh, could, you, bien. could you help me with the, the question? Sí. I, Send in the morning. Yes, I know, I'm sorry, el mercito, pero es que mira, yes, hace un día, you, de verdad que solo he pasado sentada aquí, de reunión tras reunión, en serio. Se ha dejado que este, este módulo o este nivel no, no me ha cuidado como se debe. Ay, bye, el mer. Ajá. A You're ver terrible. qué está pasando. A saber. Okay. Bye. <laughs> bye. Hi Walter, hi Ale, hi Jose. Hey. Hello. Sure. Were you able to finish, huh? guys? Yes. This one, yes. yes. Okay. So, what do you have for number one, Walter? Okay. okay. People uh, shouldn't be allowed. 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 Allowed to smoke on airplanes. Okay. Ale, what about number two? Young people um, shouldn't be permitted to get married at age 15. That's right. <laughs> Jose Ramos, what about number three? Okay, I think the people mustn't be required to resolve who must. I'm sorry. People must. must. Yes. Like, oh, Jose. <laughs> <laughs> what happened, Jose? Uh -huh. <laughs> People must be required to recycle all disposable products. Very good, yes. All right. Uh, Walter, what about laws? Laws uh, um, should be made to control people's consumption of sugar. All right, okay. All right, very good. Alejandra? People uh, shouldn't uh, be allowed to have pets in high rise apartments yes all right very good jose next one scientists mustn't be permitted to use animal for research that's right yes very good uh, jose very good and walter number seven okay uh loves uh children the past to ban the sale of handguns shouldn't or should uh, walter should Should be banned? Should, should I mean, laws should be passed to passed. ban the sale of handguns, all right? So mm -hmm. people cannot buy, like, guns, right? All right, and the last one, Ale? Um, the sale of fur products ought to be permitted. Say it again, Ale? The sale of fur uh, products uh -huh. ought to be permitted. Ought of Yeah, Auto but you think they, they, they should be permitted? I don't know. I'm just trying to um, <laughs> exercise with that one because I missed yesterday's class Sorry. and I was asking them for, like, for example, when you're using the negative uh, right. sentence. With O2, with you're, mm -hmm. I mean, we, you, you may use O2 in negative, but it's not really commonly used. So mm -hmm. usually we use shouldn't in the not to i mean it's very com out oh, i mean mm -hmm. we don't really use it in negative all right all so right. remember that auto is more like um a recommendation very near to become an obligation all right okay. so that is the slight difference between should 
because should it is like I, I, I mean we recommend something right mm -hmm. but auto is the same but with a little taste of obligation all okay right. all right okay okay mm -hmm. very good guys mm -hmm. very good okay we're gonna go back and then i'm gonna sign the other um exercise all right mm -hmm. All right, let's see. Um, Anna, can you tell us number one, please? Do you have number one, Anna? Anita, Anita, your microphone is off. Yes. <laughs> All, uh, people. I agree. People shouldn't. No, I no, no la copié esa, teacher. Sorry. What happened? Um, <laughs> all right. Okay. Mario, can you do that one, please? Uh, yes. People shouldn't be allowed to smoke on airplanes. All right. People shouldn't be allowed to smoke on airplanes, right? Remember that mm -hmm. allowed is allowed. Very good. Elmer, do you have number two? Down people. Uh, shouldn't shouldn't be permitted to get married at age uh, 15. very good all right ellie can you do number three okay uh people ought to ought to be required to recycle recycle uh, recycle uh, recycle a disposable product. products very good all right nice okay then we have let me see uh mario vasquez can you do number four mario your microphone's off oh okay sorry let me think a little bit it says last the baby is made right uh-huh Okay, so I'll use, so I'll say something like this, a uh, lot uh, should be made to control people's consumption of sugar. All right, yeah, law should be made. All right, very good, nice. Uh -huh. um, yep, very good. Uh, let's see, Diego, can you do number five, please? Okay, um, people mustn't be allowed to have pets in high-rise apartment. Oh my goodness, yes, all right, very nice. Flor, can you do number six? Flor, Florcita, no? Scientists. Scientist, yes. Scientists uh, shouldn't be to use it. Shouldn't be what, Flor? Animals for, shouldn't. Shouldn't be what? Shouldn't be, shouldn't be to use animal for sure. Scientists for shouldn't be permitted for, to use no, animal for research? Permitted, permitted. Yeah, yes, permitted, permitted, right? to use animal for sure. Right, and for permit, guys, it double, you have to double the T, right? Yeah, with an R E D at the end, right? right? That's right, you have to write E-D because permitted. it's the first part is simple, that's right. Um, Eric, yeah. can you do number seven? Please. Number seven. Okay. I don't remember. Laws. Laws, uh huh. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. Laws uh, must be passed to ban the sale of handguns. Very good. Right. And Natalie, can you do number eight? Uh, uh, the sale of four products shouldn't be permitted. Excellent. Shouldn't be permitted. All right. Okay. Now I'm gonna shift. Like Hold on, I think I have that here. All right, here. All right, this is what I want us to work on right now. Should be, must be, mustn't be, shouldn't be, ought to be, has to be, has got to be. All right, so what you're gonna do right now is with this, can you take a picture of this right now, guys, please? Take a picture okay. of this one. Okay. And finished? Yep. Yep. Okay. And now I take think. a picture of this. 
Hold on, I'm going to open it. Of this one. Symbols? Yes, those symbols. Now, what I want you to do with your partners, I'm going to send you back to your groups. What I want you to do is make sentences using this what we had here, like giving recommendation or opinion using this one, should be, must be, mustn't be, participle of the verb, with these pictures, all right? Of course, you have more pictures than, than words, all right? But that's okay. So you have like enough pictures to choose from, okay? So I want you to come up with a recommendation or, or an opinion based on the picture using this uh, model, passive models. Yes? Awesome. Okay. Yeah, okay. Got it? Got yes. it. All okay. right. So let's go back to our groups and let's work on that, please. The same people that you were working with, the same um, classmate. Hi, Barbara. Hi, teacher. I'm How so are you? sorry. That's okay. <laughs> Very don't well. Worry about it. <laughs> it's been raining a lot, so I don't know if you had problems connecting or something, but that's okay. You're here. Okay, perfect. Uh, Let me send so... you to a group right now, okay? Okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you, Barbara. Okay, there you go. Thank you.
Frank. Josecito, ¿y por qué se ve así? ¿Cómo, Tiche? Así, como el fondo azul se ve. Solo eso se ve. Sí. Es que estaba atravesando, porque como usted vino tarde, me aproveché. Sorry. Es que mire, la otra clase siempre me, me atrasa un poquito. Ah, oh, vaya. Va. Sí, ok, re review, spirits. Ajá. Credit card should be used to pay university. Ok. Uh, credit card credit card should be used to pay university, not the university. Ok. People must not be allowed to swim at the beach. Ok, very nice. Vamos bien, vamos bien. Yes, very good, nice. Ok. Let's very go. good. Ayer no entró, José. Como no, teacher. Aquí estuvimos. Mm, ¿Y Diego? No, teacher. Ah, que, verdad. Weeks. That's right, Diego. It's okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's fine. All right. Keep on working, guys. No está permitido. Porque Anita, como que se why se... are you speaking Spanish? Y que mucho me cuesta explicar y lo que pasa es que tenemos diferentes puntos de vista porque ah. no entiendo, teacher, sí. Vale, por ejemplo, Eric eh, hace las, las oraciones como bien completas y yo entendía que eh, tenía que ser como algo bien general. Por ejemplo, en la número dos, uh -huh. should be paid with credit card only. Pero, ah, eh, vale, por uh -huh. ejemplo, en la número tres, Sí. Dice él, no, este, talk while you are driving must be forbidden, ¿verdad? Ok. Yo le, le estaba tratando de decir que, por ejemplo, yo mejor hubiera puesto, o sea, el uso del celular no está permitido, nada okay. más. Ok, all right. ¿verdad? Pero no sé si eso está correcto, o sea, sí, o, o, o sea, si vamos bien así o, o no. Sí, o ah, sea. Porque no sé si, si las podemos. O sea, la idea. Ya. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Es como hacer, primero hacer estructurar estructuralmente correcta, ¿verdad? Eso uno. Y lo otro, si usted le puede poner como más, más palabras o hacerlas como más largas o más complex, es como mejor, ¿verdad? Porque usted va como poniendo en práctica todo lo demás. Entonces, Ajá. traten de hacerlo pues, un poquito o entre los dos, ¿verdad? Así como que ni tan tan ni muy muy mal. Sí, pero es que uh -huh. así tenemos las primeras tres. No sé okay. si se las puede compartir, Eric, o no las ha escrito. Yeah. Si no me da chance y se las... No, yeah. Ah, ok. Para que ella las revise. Ok. No, uh, you can share. Yes, yes. With her. Uh, yes. I, I have the, the sentence. Ok. Todo lo que tiene que dejar de, de compartir la pantalla para que... Ah, sorry. Ajá. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> ok. Uh, can you see it? Yes. People okay. mustn't be allowed to swim in this area. Should we pay with credit card? Talk while you're driving must be for meeting. Ok. Eh, les, number one is perfect. People mustn't be allowed to swim in this area. Perfect. Number two, should be paid with credit card. What, Ana? What should be paid with credit card? Ah, esa era la, la duda, porque él, por ejemplo, decía que le pusiéramos en, en the store, algo así. Okay. O sea, the store uh, should be paid with credit card. Uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, you can, I mean... You can say the bill should be paid with credit card, the shirt should be paid with credit card, the, uh, I don't know, the, um, the car should be, whatever you want to pay with credit card should be at the beginning, all right? Si usted la deja como la tenía, should be paid with credit card, uh, my mm -hmm. question would be what, right? Mm -hmm. So you need to tell me what should be paid with credit card. All the utility bills should be paid with credit card, for example. or mm -hmm. um, Tuition for, um, from school should be paid with credit cards, okay? So you have to tell me what it is paid, all right? Um, in that one, Anna, I think you have to, you can leave it, the store should be paid with credit card instead of in the store. Omit in, Anna. Okay. All right? And then for the last one, talk while you're driving must be forbidding. 
You can say uh, speaking on the phone should be, um, should be, okay, let's see. Well, no, talking while you are driving must be forbidden. Yeah, talking while you're driving. So it matches talking while you're driving must be forbidden. Talking, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Talking. Yeah, but the talking. rest is fine. Talking while you're driving must be forbidden. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. It's okay. 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 All right, very good, nice. Okay, thank you, teacher. Yeah, thank you. Uh -huh. Elmer, my dear teacher, how are you? Fine, come along. I talk about you, teacher. Why Fine. are you talking about me? How about you? Good day on tomorrow. Ah, all I right. I got to the dinner. Uh, it's your birthday uh, tomorrow. Yes, yeah, it is my birthday yeah. tomorrow. Oh, uh, <laughs> nice. So, and we don't have class tomorrow. Of course, we do, Mario. I'm uh, sorry. But <laughs> you work, you work all day in, in, in English class. All day. Pretty much, yes. Wow. Yeah, I have four I admire you. <laughs> I teach four classes online and then I have meetings from UCA University and from Evangelica University because we're planning the semester for the next you know, when you, when you ask for a date is a uh, very busy yeah. All time. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, Elmer. Elmer nunca me va a perdonar. Yes. Nice, nice. Well, how do you say me dejo plantado? No, mentira. No lo dejé plantado. <laughs> That's not true. How do you say, teacher? I don't know. But you no, ask no. Jessica for a date and she no, said yes. No. You go to the restaurant and then she didn't went to the restaurant. Yeah, yeah. That's, <laughs> that, that's right. Very, it's, very it's, mean. Exactly. No. Yeah. Wow. Very yeah, mean, yeah. Jessica. That's not true. Yeah. No, yeah, that's not it's true. true. Elmercito, yes, it's true. last year, he was very kind of inviting me for lunch right mm. but then that day no four days before i started working at uca so i couldn't go mm. and then he thinks that i left him plantado but that's not true <laughs> and, and they and say and say it's uh ah, pero, dinner por, it pero, is, pero is for no, dinner que también en diciembre con noemi nos reunimos para conocernos invitamos a elmer y él dijo que no Entonces, vaya, he got even. I, wa oh. I want to go along with only with no. you. No. Oh, well, yeah, <laughs> yes. Elmer. <laughs> Ay, Elmer, show me the sentences, Elmer. Por eso entré, para ver las oraciones. Apúrese. No la hicimos, tiché. ¿Por qué? <laughs> ¿Por qué no? Oh, Estamos okay. jugando ahí. Jugando. <laughs> ¿En serio sí, no las hicieron, I, I, Elmer? No, no, solo, solo, solo only la, only with discussion. When you, you watch uh, this picture and, mm -hmm. and have a circle with a, how do you say pleca? Diagonal. Diagonal. A dash, Diagonal. a line or something. Uh -huh. dash. Yeah. When, when you, you watch that, you, uh, uh, is, is uh, necessary, must be. For example, okay. in, in this case, you, Mustn't be uh, uh, swimming in, in the Pero no está siguiendo la estructura, pool. mi amigo Elmer. Mustn't be swimming? Should not uh, be allowed to swim. Should not to... be. Should not be allowed to swim. Okay. Or mustn't be permitted to swim? Yes. In this case, for example, you, you, in, in, in the people should be eh uh, chu chu eh uh, perdón mus, musan mustn't be used uh -huh. mustn't be used the cell phone in the classroom for example okay right so cell phones mustn't be used in the classroom mustn't uh-huh uh -huh. mustn't be used in, this, in the classroom uh-huh in this case um uh, and the uh, people mustn't be 
a girl in the eight in the classroom. Mm -hmm. But, but Elmer, you need to pay attention to the structure. Acuérdese que son pasivas, right? So we have to say mm -hmm. ice cream or food is not a lot. I mean, mustn't be. Ah, in, this case, in this case, I, I, I start with the, with the action. That's right. With the thing, oh, okay. with the object. With the thing, yeah. With the thing, yeah. All right. For example, in, in this case, it's a uh, word to the uh, grass. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, must, mustn't shouldn't, be, shouldn't be allowed. Shouldn't be allowed, right. Okay. Shouldn't be allowed, okay. No, shouldn't be permitted, right. Okay. And we have a, for a, a pair of questions. With uh -huh. the symbol belong to the person he was uh, taking a shower, what's the mm -hmm. meaning of this symbol, Jessica, from the... With the arrow? Yeah, the arrow. <laughs> and with that, like, uh, I don't know what that what means. I have no idea. About, uh, to be honest, belong to free Wi Fi, yeah. um, and the other, the, the chucho cagando is, is okay. Is it? Is it? Yeah, it is. It is. Uh, I guess dogs are not allowed to litter in the street on the street. <laughs> I guess so. Okay, all right. Pero okay. ese de la flecha, no sé, de la otra que parece planchita tampoco. Uh -huh. Okay, so you and should iron. Eh, your um, clothes should be ironed by Elmer. <laughs> so I guess. No se hace. No se hace. Okay, teacher. All right. Bye. All right. Okay. No esté hablando de mí. Dios. <laughs> no, no esté hablando de usted. Vale, vale. Bye. Sí, bye. Tu menor es de edad. Hi Barbara. Hi. On the rage. Hi Ellie. Hi. Hi. People mustn't be allowed to swim. Pedestrians should be required to use zebra crossing. Zebra crossing. Oh. And Visa crossing. and Mastercard should be accepted, of course. <laughs> Cell phones mustn't be allowed while driving. People must be, excuse me, required to take a shower before entering to a swimming pool. Before entry. Before enter. Entry. Before, before entering, entering. Ah, okay. uh -huh. Entering so. the swimming pool. Animals mustn't be fed. Very nice sentence. Food mustn't be allowed inside. People should be required to go to the left or to, to go, go on, to go on the left. Ah, okay, on the on the left, right? Bus okay. ought to be stopped in a bus stop. I think it would be better if it says buses. Oh, to be stopped only in ah. a bus stop, right? In plural, only yeah. in ah ah uh huh. The bus smoking stop. shouldn't be allowed in public places, and alcoholic beverages shouldn't be sold to we work working or um, underage. Yes, shouldn't be sold to underage kids, I guess. Uh huh. To menor, menores de edad. To, uh -huh. to kids. To menores de edad. To, to kids. Sold? Two kids, yeah. Or okay. two okay. kids, yes. Yeah, so they're they are very nice, very well written. Excellent, guys. Wow, girls, girl power. <laughs> very good. <laughs> Barbara, ¿qué se había hecho? You won't believe me, but I always forget the hour. So when, <laughs> okay. when I, I realized it was 11 o'clock or so. No oh, way. So <laughs> okay, that's okay. <laughs> I believe you. That happens. All right. Girls, they are very well done. Thank you very much. They are super, super nice sentences. Thank you. Okay. Thank okay. you. Right. Thank you. Uh, we're going to go back right now, but I'm going to ask you guys to share these sentences with the rest of the class, okay? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, guys, we're about to finish. I just, I was talking to Natalie, Ellie, and Barbara, and we were like looking, um, going over her, their sentences, and their sentences are really, really well written. So I'm gonna ask uh, the girls to share them with you guys. So you just take a look at them, please. So Natalie, or I don't know who was sharing the screen. Do you mind sharing with Natalie. the rest? I know it's almost time Natalie. to go, but. 
who had them, Natalie or, or Barbara? Natalie. It's Natalie. Ah, all right. Natalie, do you mind sharing the screen for a second? Natalie, Natalie. No? What happened, Natalie? The post, you, did she frozen? Okay, she's frozen. Natalie, are you frozen? <laughs> no? Wave at me. <laughs> All right, but I think, guys, that it was better. Um, you guys understood it better today than yesterday, but it was because um, it was my fault. All right, I think it was better today. Just remember that whenever you use passive models, you, you have to follow that structure, all right? And usually we have the object, as Elmer was saying, with Mario, the object happens to be first. For example, credit cards. I mean, I don't know. Uh, the TV should be paid with um, credit card, all right? Or swimming mustn't be allowed in this area. All right, so you just need to remember to follow that structure, okay? Well, I don't know if, and Natalie, did you, were you able to show them, um, Natalie? Are you able to share them? No, I guess not. All right, anyway, um, guys, we have a class. I mean, we do have class tomorrow and Thursday. Tomorrow, I'm, I'm just going to uh, review the sentences that Natalie had because I really wanted to show them. And then we're going to go over the last topic of this section, which is tag questions, okay? It shouldn't be difficult. We have seen tag questions before, at least with the students that have been with me for a while. So it's not something new. But again, we're going to review them and everything just in case you have um, some doubts or some questions about them, all right? So thank you very much for being with me another night. We have two more classes and we are free for a week. Okay? okay. Know, eh? <laughs> so thank you so much, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay? See you tomorrow. Bye, guys. Good night. Bye. See you later, alligator. Bye-bye.